Hello everyone, welcome back to the YouTube channel. Today, we are going to talk about something truly remarkable, something that is not just changing the way we see defense, but also defining our national pride and sovereignty. Yes, I'm talking about the Made in Philippines Defense Technology of 2026, a milestone that shows the world what our country is capable of when innovation, dedication, and patriotism come together. Imagine a country that once depended heavily on other nations for its defense needs. Today, that same country is developing cutting-edge technology right here at home, protecting its borders with weapons, vehicles, drones, and advanced systems designed by Filipino engineers and scientists. This is not just about military might, it's a story of passion, intelligence, and the relentless spirit of our youth. Each Baros 2026 assault rifle, Kalasog V infantry fighting vehicle, Mabuhay D-1 drone, Aguila patrol craft, and Bante Digital Cyber Defense Center represents a dream turned into reality. Let's start with the Baros 2026 assault rifle. This is more than a weapon, it's a symbol of precision, reliability, and trust in our local engineers. Designed specifically for our soldiers, it is meant to keep them safe while giving them the tools to defend our country effectively. Every component of this rifle is made in the Philippines, showing that we have the expertise and capability to create world-class defense equipment. When our soldiers carry this rifle, they are not just carrying a weapon, they are carrying the pride, skill, and hard work of an entire nation. Then there is the Kalasog V Infantry Fighting Vehicle, a marvel of engineering and design. This vehicle is built to withstand the harshest conditions while keeping our troops protected. Equipped with modern weapon systems and defensive features, it allows our soldiers to carry out their missions with confidence and safety. When our troops patrol the borders in this vehicle, it is more than a strategic advantage, it is a statement of strength, resilience, and national determination. The Mabuhay D-1 drone is another shining example of our technological progress. These drones can perform surveillance, gather intelligence, and monitor potential threats with remarkable precision. They are transforming our defense strategy by providing real-time information and rapid responses to any situation. Each drone represents not only technological advancement but also the forward-thinking approach of our young innovators. These drones ensure that the Philippines is not just reacting to threats, but proactively securing its future. Our maritime security has also seen a revolution with the Aguila patrol craft. Fast, durable, and equipped with advanced weapons, these crafts safeguard our waters and maritime boundaries. They protect trade routes, respond to emergencies, and act as a visible presence of our country's strength at sea. Each patrol craft is a reminder that our nation can protect its sovereignty across land, sea, and air. Equally important is the Bante Digital Cyber Defense Center. In today's world, conflicts are not limited to the battlefield, they extend into cyberspace. This center safeguards our digital infrastructure, prevents cyber attacks, and ensures the security of critical information. It demonstrates that our defense is comprehensive, covering physical threats and digital dangers alike. Our nation is prepared, vigilant, and resilient in every domain. What makes all of this truly remarkable is that it is powered by the passion, creativity, and dedication of our youth. Each technology, each vehicle, each system tells a story a story of self-reliance, innovation, and national pride. It is proof that the Philippines is capable of standing on its own, producing cutting-edge solutions, and contributing meaningfully to global defense standards. This development is not just about security, it also strengthens our economy. By producing defense technology locally, we create jobs for thousands of young professionals, stimulate our industries, and enhance economic growth. The ripple effect of this initiative extends far beyond defense, it empowers communities, inspires innovation, and fosters national unity. As we witness these achievements, it is impossible not to feel a sense of pride and hope. We are seeing a future where the Philippines is not just a participant in global affairs, but a leader in defense technology. This progress is a beacon of what dedication, hard work, and patriotism can achieve. It is a reminder that when we believe in our people and invest in their potential, there are no limits to what we can accomplish. Friends, now is the time to recognize and appreciate the efforts of our young innovators, to value our nation's defense systems, and to understand that every effort made today strengthens our homeland tomorrow. 
This is the spirit that is making the Philippines in 2026 a strong, self-reliant, and proud nation. Every time we see a Barros 2026 in the hands of a soldier, a Kalasog V rolling across the borders, a Mabuhay D1 soaring above, or an Aguila patrol craft guarding our waters, we are reminded of our national capability. We are reminded that every Filipino has the power to contribute, to innovate, and to make a difference. In conclusion, the journey of the Philippines' defense technology is a journey of courage, resilience, and hope. It is a story of a nation that dared to dream, believed in its people, and is now realizing those dreams in tangible, inspiring ways. The future is bright, and every innovation, every system, every effort is a step toward a safer, stronger, and more sovereign Philippines. So, let us celebrate this achievement, support our innovators, and continue to stand united as we move toward a future filled with progress, security, and national pride. The Philippines is proving, in 2026 and beyond, that we have the vision, talent, and determination to lead and inspire the world.